Welcome back to 49ers Sack High Sports. The Central Catholic Raiders start off the season 2-0 and are set to face a North Coast section team for Game 3. San Ramon Valley very impressive in their opening win last week, taking the 60-mile trip from Danville over to Modesto to meet up with the Raiders. Our Brian Mueller breaks down the interleague matchup in our Some Power Electric Game. Electric Game. Heading south down 99 for our Sun Power Electric game, a matchup between two unbeaten teams, 1-0 San Ramon Valley visiting 2-0 Central Catholic in Modesto. And the Raiders feature a fierce running attack led by one of the greatest nicknames I've ever heard of for a running back, Aiden Ponyboy Taylor. Ponyboy has galloped for 200 yards this year, including 131 yards and four touchdowns in a win last week against St. Mary's. But that rushing attack will be tested by a tough SRVD. Case in point, senior Tyler Hoffman, who's coming off a five sack game against Bishop O'Dowd. First ever meeting between these two teams for our Sun Power Electric game. The Wolves would jump out to the early lead, Jack Quigley. Throws a strike to Caden Ridley. It's a 54-yard score, and SRV leads five minutes in. But the Raider D would settle down later in the quarter. They do a good job of containing Quigley in the backfield. Romeo Atiki and Diego Armstrong both there for the sack. Central Catholic gets on the board late in the second. Tyler Wentworth rolls out, way out, and slings it to Sebastian Guzman, who makes a great catch in the end zone. We are tied at seven. The Wolves trying to break that tie right before the half, about 10 seconds left. Nolan Crosdale gets all up in this pass, and they give him the interception after both guys lay claim to it, and we are tied at seven at the half, much to the delight of Raider Nation. Third quarter now, Tyler Jacklidge looking like former Oakland Raider Marshawn Lynch on this run. He has just entered beast mode. Jumps, stiff arms, cutbacks. Jacklidge has it all on this run, and he has just enough to get in the end zone. What a play. Central Catholic takes a 14-7 lead. Later in the quarter, what can't this guy do? This time, Jack Lidge, using his arm, throws a nice ball to Crowsdale, who is just shy of the end zone. But not to worry, time to saddle up. Pony Boy takes it from here, 21 to seven Raiders. SRV would cut the lead to seven in the fourth and they get the ball back late in the game under 30 seconds to go, fourth and nine from the Central Catholic 25. Quigley tries to get a pass off, but Jericho Machado gets to him before he can, and that would do it. The Raiders pick up an impressive 21-14 win. They are now 3-0. We were always getting doubted, you know, St. Mary's last week, you know, people said we were going to lose. We came out and we beat them. And this week too, you know, I was hearing people say we're going to lose. Oh, it's Central Catholic. They're playing a big school. Well, you know, we're a little school, but we got a big team. And I think, I think we're going to go a long way. 